Back from Costco again. Yes. Another recipe with a shrimp that we picked up, $10 a pound, U15 size. And if you saw from the previous video, here we actually showed you how to make it for a nigiri. Now he's going to show you how to make it tempura style. Mm -hmm. So tempura, so also we need to keep that straight, right? So what I'm going to do, first I'm going to take all the shell. So this part is uh, sometimes so many water in it. So best way, you better squeeze out these things. Sometimes, if you don't do this, when you fry it up, bam! Yeah. So when the water meets oil, it's not yeah. going to be good. So some restaurants do this way, right? Some restaurants actually just cut on the, like this. Okay. Yeah. So this is all depend on the restaurant what to do. And then again, this is already cut, take off the vein, already out. Usually I do this this one after you peel off, right? First things, I'm gonna take the vein this from the top and the, and the vein out first. Okay. Okay. So then I wash it. Then I'm gonna start the stretch side. Okay. Yeah. So this is already vein out. So this this part is already done. Okay. Right. Okay. Next one, I'm gonna do cut couple slices in the, here. Uh, the leg side nicely don't cut all of the way you can tell like that you can cut a little more this area then I do uh, two different way one is a uh, very easy you just you can pick up the, the sound click 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 yeah click, click, click. kind of breaking the meat yeah so this is the one way Same way, in the right side, you just slice. On the bottom side, just go across, okay? Yes. And then go. Then, on the side, side away. So, bottom and both sides? Yes, and then come in this way. Oh, a lot of work. Yeah, this is very more, more work. And your skills got to be pretty good too. Like this. This is another way. Okay, so it's already done. You don't have to break the meat? No, this okay. is just like this. When I was in Japan, uh, working in the restaurant, I usually do, because at other times, they don't have a stretched shrimp. Now you can buy a stretched shrimp, right? So, um, what kind of, it's a case, of, I think, uh, a bit of four pound a case, right? So, five, five case a day. I have to make this one. Oh, yeah. At least, a lot of work, a lot of good practice. At least, yeah. The good so old days. I start with this way. Okay. Yeah, sometimes I do the two shrimp at the same time, but two shrimp the way, uh, another way is actually after peel it off and then these things together, you know. Okay. And then, then I use a small deva knife to punch it like this way. Okay. It's the most easiest way to do it. Kind of flatten out. Yeah. Okay. So that's another way. So I'm gonna make a couple of pieces like that. Which style are you going to do? This is more easier. Okay, let's do that one. <laughs> the way you break it. Yeah, I, I'm gonna show you a couple of times uh, that all the different ways. Uh, break down. And then of course take on, oh, this is already broken. And uh, this So this is just tempura flour? Tempura, this is tempura flour, just okay. attaching to the shrimp like that. And just, uh, This is just one. tempura batter. Tempura batter. Lift up the shrimp, let's see how thick it is. How Let me thick see the batter, yeah. Like okay, this. so it's got to be enough to stay yeah. in the shrimp, but not yeah. too, too thick. Mm -hmm. 
だけど、OK? OK。I notice Hero holds it a little bit before he drops it in. He doesn't yeah, just... this is a very thing, you know, not, not deep. This、uh, so player says it's not deep, so I, I need to watch it. Normally, you just drop it in if it was deeper? Yeah, if deeper, no problem. You、okay. just put it in, you know. Yeah, I see you're holding it. So look how straight that shrimp is. If you put it in too fast, it's going to all curl up. Yeah. Or it won't be straight. So that's And also,、thing. sometimes you can stick on the bo- bottom too, you know. Yeah, to make sure、so、it doesn't stick on the bottom. Stick on the bottom. You, you just make sure. And after one done, you can you know, put in another one. Okay. So, this one you just see when you pick up, th- this thing is already getting hard, right? Crunchy, right?、Yeah. This is already done. Okay. Like that. So, some restaurants put a lot of tempera flakes on the. Yeah, yeah, that's old, stu-、yeah. old school style. I don't see people doing it that way、yeah. anymore. But、so、on the outside, with a lot of little flakes attached to it, you know? Yeah, but I, I like it. <laughs> you like that style? Oh, especially if you put into the udon noodle. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hot, hot udon noodle. I don't see that people doing that anymore. They just do the shortcut. Yeah. Not really Japanese style anymore. See, this is it. This is done. Okay. Like that. Very good. So simple, huh? Yeah, very simple. Very simple. If you made a stretch your shrimp. Actually, in the house, in the house, when you do, you, do, you really don't need to be stretch. It's just a just whole make thing. Just make a whole、okay. thing. <laughs> That's true. But this is nicer, right? A little nicer. It's longer. Yeah. Looks like there's more shrimp to enjoy. Yeah, if you are putting to the sushi roll, maybe this is a way it's more better, right? Yeah, for the roll, that's why we do it this way. Again, coming up in the next video, here's gonna put everything together. Doing a recipe with the shrimp tempura as well as the boiled shrimp that you do for nigiri. So, this one you can do two, two pieces together. If your flyer is more bigger. Okay.、Mm. In the restaurant, I do two pieces together, you know. I just keep a grub like this, two pieces like this, then I do that. that okay. That. Temperature control is very important. In the restaurant, you have an automatic one, but in this case, you have to be controlled, you know? Yeah. Give too much heat, it's not good. It's g o n n a burn out the flour. You don't want that to happen.、Mm-hmm. If it wasn't hot enough, it's g o n n a be very greasy.、Mm. And the tempera butter better keep always cold. Yeah. Okay. That's another key, too. Okay, here's Han. So it's finished.、Mm. Beautiful shrimp tempura. Huge. U15 size from Costco. All right, let's try it out. Okay. I'll put here. Okay. I'm going to put a little salt. Okay. Oh, hear the crunch. Mmm. How's it? Again. The shrimp is so good. The shrimp is so、mm. good, right? One of my favorite things to eat of all time is shrimp tempura. Hero, can you put some salt for me?、Mm. I love shrimp tempura. Just like it is. There used to be a Chinese restaurant by where I used to live. I mean, it's so good. Take a look at this. Mmm. Mmm. That, my friend, is so good. <laughs> Bring back my childhood memories、mm-hmm. from where I grew up. So, so good. Next time I, we can, I can make a e b i fry.、Mm. You know, tonkatsu, right?、Mm-hmm. The bread, the one.、Mm. That was nice too. Okay, very good. 
shrimp tempura and, and the ebi fry. Mm. I, I like both. We, we just don't call, I don't know why, but we don't call ebi katsu. Mm -hmm. If you bread it with pork, we call it katsu. Right. But, uh, shrimp is ebi fry. That's so funny. Fry. <laughs> You're missing the best part. I eat those all the time. Yeah, this is actually clean up. Mm -hmm. You can eat. It's so good. Well, Harold, thank you so much. Thank you. We'll see you guys soon.